Call of Duty just released a surprise free Monster Energy Operator skin for all users. I'll go through how to get it for a limited time, plus more updates in today's video. Be sure to drop a like in the video if you're going to enjoy. But first off, here, link is down below. It is so, so simple to get. Sign into your Activision account, and you should see this pop up on screen. Just unlocked Clutch Operator skin. So it is really simple. Of course, make sure the account you're signing into is connected to the platform you want the Operator skin on. You may be able to get it on multiple platforms as well. They're really giving it to everyone here, and it seems like they're doing this for a new monster energy call of duty collaboration i saw today a lot of youtubers and streamers are now partnered with monster energy that would be a pretty sick collab honestly so they're doing this in honor of that and there's other stuff happening as well ever wonder how you stack up have aiden or huskers guess your resurgence rank post the clip on x by tagging cod monster energy cod monster plays and your skill division must be on fortunes keep in ranked resurgence using the monster skin so if you guys want to do that take part in that there that's pretty interesting but of course for the skin itself it's a bbq opera skin the same operator we had the other previous monster energy skins for we have the beast operator skin which was pretty cool the zero chill one as well the beast up one which was a newer one just added and of course the newest one right now the beast operator skin here now they say clutch it doesn't say clutch here it just says the beast so it's probably a typo but this obviously is the new operator skin that just got available for all players here so if you guys didn't take part in that previous monster promotion you won't have access to those other operator skins but you will have access to this one up on screen which is a pretty cool one it's a bit of a purple and black vibe with that green monster logo as well pretty solid operator don't know how long this is gonna be available for so again be sure to click that link down below redeem it while it's still available and of course before we break down some more stuff here quick shout out to u4gm if you need cheap cop points rare unlock codes mastery camos and much more there's a bunch of stuff over there use code map for an extra five percent off links down below but for more updates here of course we talk about the gassed up weapon vault bundle being 3400 cop points which was the most expensive bundle to date and this is what happened here the gassed up weapon vault bundle has been temporarily removed from the store due to a pricing error the intended price is 2400 cop points players who purchase this bundle for 3400 cop points will soon be refunded the difference of a thousand cop points and today we got this here 1000 cop points have now been refunded to players who previously purchased the gassed up weapon vault bundle so let me know down below if you got that bundle before if you did actually get your thousand cop points back and hopefully there is a glitch to where even if you didn't get the bundle they accidentally just gave us all thousand cop points i feel like that would be a pretty w decision by call of duty i do appreciate the free operator skin the event cosmetics the mastery camos we're getting it's all cool but having a random update where they just decide to give us 500 a thousand cop points maybe even 2400 cop points for free all players so you can get any bundle of your choosing that would be a pretty cool thing for them to do just to increase the morale of call of duty players so will they ever do that maybe maybe not oh, let me know down below your opinions on that i feel like that would be pretty sick but for more updates here this is so so interesting we have a new promotion with uh modern warfare 3 and a gold bar and silver bar company i don't think this is from call of duty themselves it's uh from pamp some interesting company there so you're pretty much buying a silver and gold block it's real silver real gold and it has a cool little captain price uh thing inside of it uh it, it looks pretty cool but the problem is here it's way too expensive for what you're actually getting an ounce of silver right now is about 20 to 25 dollars and it costs a hundred dollars here for this promotion so i get they want to make a profit but that's just not worth it now you do get a cool in-game charm but that's all you get there so the charm is cool here's a look at it on some weapons but is it worth that much probably not honestly if you got a cool mastery camo or something even crazier an operator skin a completely gold and silver operator or a completely gold captain price operator like that would be maybe worth it but a hundred bucks or however much the gold one is and you're just getting a weapon charm i don't know about that let me know down below if you'll be getting that one there but for some more updates here of course i give you guys my pickems for the cdl matches every week if you correctly predict matches you'll get extra double xp cosmetics and much more here's what i did for week one i think i did pretty good i only got two matches wrong and those two matches are the matches that could have been toss up carolina could have easily won that match and then uh, lag could have definitely beat vegas there but for the most part pretty accurate with my predictions here are my week two predictions for this weekend's matches first off i have a new york and boston a close match here new york is apparently playing every game super super close they almost lost to carolina which was pretty surprising i mean carolina did beat them on land new york just looks shaky right now in boston the new pickup asim looks pretty solid so i do still have new york beating them 3-2 i think new york is still the better search team but boston is getting better they could easily win that one this one here though optic and rocker this should be an optic win 
every day of the week rocker it's still good they got top four at the major but for the most part optic should definitely win this one here i have 3-1 for them that's a double points match as well next one here we have vegas and miami i think right now vegas seems to be pretty good with their new pickup of geo i think miami could get better they're not a bad team but they've definitely fallen off a lot since the beginning of the year and right now vegas looks to be you know pretty hot honestly so i'm expecting a 3-1 win from them now for saturday we have toronto and vegas toronto should definitely win this i have them winning 3-1 although rocker almost reversed sweeped toronto which is kind of crazy but toronto still best team in the game they just won the major and they should definitely beat vegas which is a bottom tier team optic lag next match here optic 3-0 i mean lag is good i guess uh but optic is just so dominant i don't see lag upsetting them in any mode honestly but you know you never know what might happen there maybe a hard point but I, even optic is really good at hard point too so optic should definitely win that one 3-0 there 3-1 maybe uh los angeles thieves and miami as well this is another close one to where uh, miami was previously the better team i still have them winning 3-2 la thieves probably like one of the worst teams bottom two in the league right now they don't win any hard points they have one hard point win on the year could they get an upset win probably i mean i could have you know three you could easily do three two thieves but i have three two miami i think miami has a little better just gun power and a little more skill at least right now not that thieves won't have that skill in the future they just formed and traded out two players while miami just made a one person change it's easier to manage off of that so i don't know i have miami getting a three two win there a close match now for the next one carolina and seattle another toss up honestly i do have faith in carolina i do think they're the better team seattle dropped their best player Philly. so and after that they played phase they didn't look that good at all so i think right now seattle not looking too good for this major here you never know they might surprise us but i have carolina winning this one here next we have boston and rocker another close match here i have rocker beating out boston boston got top 12 rocker got top four now boston did make a change but for the most part i still think rocker is a pretty good team i think Linz is better than any player on boston right now i think snoopy on boston has a lot of potential but Linz right now on rocker seems to be really really good and probably could carry them to a pretty close victory and finally here we have new york and phase could be close but phase got second at the major and new york got top 12 and new york has been shaky with so many matches here you gotta pick phase in that one so those are the pickups up on screen let me know down below if you agree disagree and of course if you predict matches correctly you'll get extra double xp cosmetics stuff like that and for the upcoming major as well of course we're gonna have more blueprints cosmetics weapon charms all that good stuff that you'll get by just watching matches so if you watch normal league matches like this weekend or next weekend or last weekend you'll get double xp double up and xp as long as your youtube account is connected to your activation account but for the big major event this one's gonna be in miami you'll get more cosmetics that you could actually use in game that i'll talk about on the channel but overall that's it here for this video be sure to subscribe for the latest cod update videos like this shout out to youtube channel members as always and i'll see you guys in the next video or live stream peace out guys